Hi everyone, welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. Uh, Ken's waiting in the room that we were kind of in already. Uh, we're trying to figure out the door, the mystery of the door. Can you... I guess you can't pick the lock? No, I can't. Lock level 5, so... We either need a key for this or something else. Isn't there like a painting on the wall that... that how about this button? What did that do? I guess that revealed that, the passageway? Yeah, that revealed the, uh, the passageway. Press it again for shifts and giggles, though. Let's see. Key See, if you walk over here and hold Alt, you'll see there's the key on the side of the door. Uh, which begs the question of how do we get to that key? I think I could teleport you to it. No, feel free to try. Maybe there's like a hole somewhere. Actually, wait, the antler. What the hell? Why, how can I loot the antler? <clears throat> well, let's see. Let's see if I can teleport one of us. I think maybe, maybe it's also a matter of telekinesis. Maybe you're supposed to... Maybe that's the way the game's way of going. Oh, you could have done telekinesis. But I have telekinesis. Maybe not enough. Oh yeah, no, maybe. Come on, sec. Come, come over here. Where's my telekinesis gone? You don't have it anymore. Actually, I'll, I'll send my character over there. Actually. Target is out of sight. How do I not see that? I, I don't know, we, we made it down there before. I know we've been down there in other playthroughs, but like now it's locked. Uh, I don't know. Heat. By the way, if you get warm twice, you get uh, you get set on fire. Nice. Okay, read that, that in the comments. That, that is apparently... How to, huh? No, no, I actually looked it up at some point. Alright. I, I don't actually know how to get there, you're right. Maybe... I've got a hunch. You got a hunch? I remember that this, this area down here is tied in with one of the quest starts in uh, the town that you've not looked at at all. Uh, it is totally door to harbor. No, but we we've done that one. Uh, no, I know what's down here. I know what the quest is down here. But we've not talked to the NPC at all. Uh, which one is that? Uh, the, the headless. One? The head. The head has to do it. Uh, yeah, the head. Is that what you think it is? I think that's what it is. I think my, I think it's the only thing I can you think what? of. You know, I, I'm I'm gonna look it up just in case, and then we'll decide. Oh wait, what the fuck, Mike? Mike, what? I did it. What? <laughs> Telekinesis you, you, you is the got, best. You got oh the tell you did the teleporter period. Hold up, I think I, I telekinesed it through the fucking door. Wow. Okay. That, that, and that seems more like a bug than anything, but okay. We did it! Solved the I, problem! Also, I'm pretty sure that you're supposed to be able to do it otherwise. <laughs> you took the key from me. Alright, whatever. We're pivot. Ah, oh, God! No! Give me a what, what do you keep doing? What did you right click Take it! The I'm a left clicking it, you prick! Yo, go open Fucking the chest. Fight me, piece of shit! Open the chest. Okay, can we actually duel each other? I wonder. Wow. Ow. I think you're almost. Oh, one sec. Let me save you. <laughs> no. No, I couldn't do it. What? I I didn't heal you. Well. I, I maybe I should raise your perception. <laughs> maybe. Just in the chest. Oh, nothing. <laughs> you got the loot before you died. Yeah. <laughs> What did you take me for? Fucking res me. I'm not wasting Medora's scrolls. She needs those. <laughs> Fuck, I'm running out. You're not running out. You're like 20. You didn't, actually. Maybe I'm my character. John only well, John only has one left. Oh, well, look at John. How much do I have? Three There's on this person. You did not give me 20. Well, I hope sounds exaggerating. Obviously. God. Obviously. Obviously. All right, let me go uh, do burn your eyes. I have a lot of fucking spells now. Oh man, my gloves are broken now. What do you even get? <laughs> yeah, I got, I got a fucking heavy cleat. Wasn't worth it. <laughs> Wasn't worth it. Well then, um, you have to lead because I'm, I'm not I'm worried about this. By the way, at some point, we, you know what we could have done for the mines? We could have made someone immune to fire. Because I used to have a spell for that, but now I think I don't. I'm kind of just looking through this. I think one of our amulets gave it to us. 
Maybe do you have the amulet? Uh, the avatar of fire thing? Yeah. Oh, trap. Uh, I guess we'll make it rain. Make it rain. I think I sold an amulet because it was, you know, no one wanted to use it. But it, it, it would be useful in this situation. Because <laughs> ah, then you, you'd never take damage. Why are you talking Dora, to Dora? I swear to God, I'm trying to click strategically. Look out, I see a trap nearby. That's, uh, what is that? Is that even a trap? What is that? What is this? Isn't that the thing that makes the, uh... Oh, no, the, oh, I see, there's a fucking... Uh, there's a trigger panel for that. Oh, you're fine. Try to get drunk. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh god. Make it rain on them hoes. <laughs> what is it? What have I done? Joy doesn't have enough life for this. It's kind of fine. I first aided him. That was the trap. I thought I thought I would just put it over, but it made like an oil slick and then shift from the bottom. I guess, I guess you don't need healing, do you? Sweet relief. There you go. Oh man, our heads. All right, what else could we die to in this cave? I fucking I don't know. Burn my eyes and we'll find out. Oh, fuck it hell. Into the fray once more. You really need some more perception. Fuck you, you do a perception. You look a trap. Well, how do we disarm that one? Oh, and you just I fucking... An I just... Oh, whoops, I just minimized my own game. Uh, because I clicked what on the wrong, do wrong you screen. Good. I don't want to nope. talk to Joanne. I have a plan. What's your plan? A strange sword appeared. There must Dora, be a way Medora, to Medora, Medora. Dora, this isn't hard. She's learned. I'm trying so hard, Mike. I tried so hard. Alright, right, alright. What if I just... <laughs> can you not... Can you not... <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> For the love of fuck. You know, I'm thinking... I'm thinking I'm just gonna send a, a, send a, send a teleporter pyramid down there, to be honest. <laughs> Might be the smart move instead of having me fucking wait. There's a loot there. There's a loot. Uh, some stools. One sec. Let me let me let me send a teleporter permit down there. Okay. Nice, uh, sir. No, I'm I'm teleporting it. Actually, I'm not allowed to do that. Wow. Okay. What's that what the fuck? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. What? One of these maybe go down there. I saw it. Away again. That's enough of that, Matt. <laughs> Alright, give, give her the Give her the teleporter pyramid. Okay, she has it. Alright. Uh it's not in my hot bar anymore. What? Ah, no, she doesn't. You. What? You gave it to me? What who has it? <laughs> Dora has just, <laughs> I didn't give it to her, then I Okay, now give it to yourself and then come back. Oh here. yes, boss. I understand. thank you for telling me how to do this. I'd be lost without you. I know. All right, let's, 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 let me burn your eyes again. All right, I keep forgetting who has what buffs. I have a lot of small casters to manage here. See, it wants me to pick up the raw meat. It knows me, Mike. I, I think you should do it. Totally do it. Or I'll make it rain. It's fine. Well, nothing bad happened. What the fuck? Oh no, the rat just died. That's why. I prefer to drown my sorrows the with The rat ale. just died. That's for those raw meat. I thought it was like a, a, a fucking like complex trap. Sweet relief. All right, well, guys, there's a little puzzle here. Can you solve the answer? Oh boy, there's a bunch of uh, pirate boomers just uh, kind of standing in oil. I wonder how to solve this one. Boomers. Boomer. So we're just gonna Probably go over here. the worst battle song collecting character. The worst? Or nah, I'm joking. Boomer's fine. Alright, it's going down. <laughs> that was a short fight. We did it! <laughs> we did the fight. Now let me go make yeah, it. It's still on fire, but who cares? I'm gonna make a raid, it's fine. I'm so tempted to throw the oil barrel into the fire. So what's that thing so that's tempted. What's that thing that's in the middle of the 
to water their place. Do you, do you have any idea what oh, that is? Oh, what the fuck is that? What? It's a totem. Yeah. Why is there a totem there? I don't know. Alright. Oh, a medium poison business potion. <laughs> don't mind if I do. It's all yours. First, I get drunk. I could do with a cold drink. Oh my god, it makes us warm. It makes us warm. Why, why are we warm? The totem. Oh. Kill it. Kill it with fire. Okay, please get drunk. Well, all I have to do is make it rain here. It doesn't do anything else other than that, does it? We said when it makes us warm a bunch of times, it does fuck us up. Oh, shit. Like that. What's that? I'm trying to hurt it. Oh, one sec. Yeah. Just, just kill it. You can it. die. Stop. Oh shit, kill Johan, Johan he's about to die. Where's Johan? Fuck, Fuck you, Totem. Alright, well that, that solves that one. I, I, I knew it did something, I just I don't know what. I'm sorry, whenever I scroll to the left, it like goes off my, like, it goes off, off my monitor to my other screen. It's really awkward. Alright, that, anyway, that, that totem's new, we actually never had to deal with that before, but we have enough range to deal with it, I guess. Don't mind me, I'll come when I'm sober. <laughs> Your screen Whoa. shakes every time when you do that. It's very intense when I drink, you know? <laughs> Apparently, for me as well. Alright. Smoke bombs and grenades, sounds like my kind of thing. Yeah, I should get rid of the poison trap, shouldn't it? You'd think so, yeah. wouldn't you? Ah. Oh, nice. We'll just heal, our, <laughs> heal each other. I can take care of that injury. I can take care of that injury. Boy, did I. You See, heal, the person this is like... Huh? I get the impression like this is gonna be one of the things where like we move one of the boxes and then like there's something beneath it. So I'm gonna take a safe distance, and let you die. <laughs> oh, the, no, the mines are back there. Okay, pick up the oil barrel. Just pick it up or throw it. Uh, I don't, I don't know. I don't want to have it beside Another us. All right. Oh. Yeah, you, you always want to be on the safe side in this game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let me let me it's raise fine. your perception so you can continue on. All right. Uh, thanks. <laughs> That's a raise my perception. Well, you're the one with it's the good perception. It's, Mike, it's good that you did that first. Because if you didn't, I was gonna run in the fire like that. Hey, I exploded anyway. Why, why are you talking to Medora blow? all the time? What is she possibly talking? She keeps getting in the fucking way, dude. I, I can't help it. The hell? Whenever I scroll Actually, my camera over here, it's like fucking. One second. Mike, do you want to live the dream? Uh, I, I, I. By the way, I can't move my camera that much anymore. Oh no, I can't actually. I don't know why. It's just forced me to st stay zoomed in here. Is it just me? Or She'll move, it? Mike. What, 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 what's my move? Oh, you want to go over there? Over there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> just, I, I believe. Got a. You want the loot? I don't want the loot. Well, if I can give you a teleport if I have to put it back. Striking it rich! <laughs> Stop looting me! <laughs> Striking it rich! We're just gonna skip all these traps? Yeah, fuck these traps. <laughs> nice! What? I didn't do anything, what? Ready to advance. No, Ready fuck off, Medora. Why? Ready to advance. No, what stop, Medora! <laughs> I'm trying to heal my people. Shit, I forgot the potion! No! Uh, I'll, I'll teleport you oh over there. Oh my, you see this throw? Oh, fucking god. <laughs> no, no, I'm gonna throw you over there. No, no, no. Not like this. <laughs> you took 77 damage, it's fine. One sec, I'm gonna... So you, you got everything over here already, right? Yeah. Alright. Just throw me back here. Yeah, like there's no, 
Wow, there's like no way to get over here either. All right, one second. Don't, don't, don't teleport to me yet. I'm just waiting for my thing to go off cool down. Where are you? Did you already go beside me? No. Over here. You teleported me. On, you teleported me over here. You prick. What? What do you want? Where do you want to go? Uh. I'm. I'm gonna teleport us onto the other side here with the medium resistance potion and shit. So. All right. Invalid target. Well, what? Invalid target. Stop cheating. What? It doesn't like it. It doesn't want me to teleport there. Okay, that's fine. Alright. Ha! <laughs> I bled and then I healed from it. Hey, go 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 teleport pretty baby. Why does it keep vanishing up a hot bar? Fucking hell. Can you fuck it? Yeah, because you keep removing it. Alright. You see how Oh, I'm already come with us. Good, yeah, good. Yeah, and then I just teleported myself. Oh, but there's a barrel over there I can loot. Ugh. Go for the go, go for the dream. That's an oil barrel, didn't loot that. Don't loot the oil barrel? You sure? I, I, I've been there before, man. <laughs> is that all there is here? That barrel's gonna be the one with the rail guns. I'm just telling you that now. Well. Well, you know what? I'm gonna. Taking a tumble! <laughs> so teleport to me when you're done. Should there tears for me, my glory lives forever. Empty. <laughs> no, you're gonna die. I'm not using grunt scrolls on you. Fuck oh, you. Oh, gold. <laughs> gold. <laughs> you're gonna drink your poison away. Yeah. Enjoy the screen shake, fucker. <laughs> Can you fucking just teleport to me? I can't do that. I'm, I can't drink teleport. Sure you can. I get a TUI. <laughs> you get a TUI. All right, I'll, I'll I'll actually heal you now. Oh, thanks. Well, I can't. I wasn't anywhere close to you. What are you going to do? All right. Sweet. I'm out of phone. Is there nothing over here? I guess not. On the men. Let's all go up here. I'm gonna just pretend like there's nothing here. That's that's a good that's a good strategy. And we're here. And Candace drinking again. Oh, there's headless Nick. The body stirs. The subtle slouch in its decayed shoulders suggest intense longing. A large, soggy chunk of flesh falls to the ship's floor with a melancholic thud. So this is what's to become of me, it seems to moan. A body with no head. A ship with no captain. Dejectedly, it proffers a hand. In its palm is a well-weathered notebook, only slightly sticky with rotted corpse ooze. You accept it, taking it by its spine with two ginger fingers. Your efforts at not gagging are most valiant. The bereft corpse turns from you just slightly, as if you imply it didn't want to talk to you anyway. Okay, apparently they didn't want to talk to us, but we get we get a thing over here so we can come back here. What? What? Look at that wand. The pretty okay wand. Oh, summon wolf. Shit. Summon wolf. Three uses. Duh. So if that runs out before we get a tome of summon wolf, actually we should go check and see. Let's go check with summon wolf. Yeah, you, you gave me a leadership hat at some point. And a pal I have a rain skill book. What are uh, hello? Do, do you want rain? Uh, no. I gave it to you to sell. Yeah, where's our good one? Can't sell the rain. We're good. We're, yes, we can, because I already have it on one person. We don't need it on two people. All right, I'm gonna head back to uh, Northgate and Side Seal, and you're coming with me, apparently. Yep. Yeah, why don't I stay there? What do you think I am? So there's a headless zombie, guys, and it means us no harm. So it's just one of those things. Actually, what does the quest log say for that? I'm wondering. Uh, oh, actually, no, no. We we, we want to go to the lighthouse first. Never mind. Um. You don't have to come with me for that. Is it where, where is it? The secluded beach, tranquil beach, the secluded beach? No, tranquil beach. I think you want to just leave oh. out. Um. Ah, uh, here we are. Okay, we're going to the lighthouse because do you, you guys remember a while back we 
Uh, well, actually, it was like I think that was like last episode from your guys' perspective. We met that person that was a um, uh, fine, upstanding individual in society. So we're, I'm just looking for the, the the lighthouse right now. It's right this way. So she was sunk by the person in the lighthouse. So we're gonna c come over to the lighthouse and talk to her because she—that's where she went. But we're gonna finish up that quest line. We're actually almost done in this this place though, which is interesting. Well, I still got a whole other area to fuck with, but yeah, almost. Almost done. There's a rat here. I'm gonna attack the rat. You hear that? It sounds like wailing. There aren't ghosts around here, are there? There aren't ghosts around here, are there? Alright, let's go light the torch. The lighthouse still on? I can't really tell. Alright. Desdemona, my love. I should have known you would never betray me. I should have known your love to be as constant as the sky. Madness took hold of my heart, and with razor nails scratched murderous intent into its depths. Uh, I'm just talking to them right now. They just they, they immediately got into a conversation, but then I went down the, <laughs> the stairs. And yet, look at us now. Not even death could impede our reunion. I beg of you, my love. Forgive me. With but a word, you can heal my heart. Efface the scars that lunacy left there. Forgive me, my wife, my own. Forgive me. You. You've heard the whole story by now. Perhaps you can help me settle my mind. Half of me is furious, and the other half is utterly enraged. What do you think of my murderer husband? Uh, let's see. Ah, <clears throat> uh, let's see. Samson forgive. is truly repentant. Desdemona ought to forgive him so they can both move on. Indeed. Samson committed a terrible deed, but I've never seen one so utterly filled with regret. Continue. I suppose. I suppose you're right. The deed is done, and I can do naught but move forward now. Samson, I do forgive you. I do. Ta da! Shining soul, my love. Do we, do we get From any set of kisses? Purity, even the diamond hides uh, compassionate. its complexion and shame. So, we got a um, critical chance increased by 3%, opposed to again. chance to hit bonus when backstabbing, so which we never want to do. I'll do this as a skeleton. Yes. The past is the past, my Let's darling. Wait for the loot. Let's go forward together <laughs> now, hand in hand into the next life. Did it actually give you loot? These ghosts are Motherfuckers! They think they'll find happiness now. <laughs> fucking you you fucking jazz! <laughs> even in death. Come on, Grumps. Mm. It ain't so dire as all that. They'll probably kick off their ghostly boots and have a nice time of eternity. Okay, well, we're done with that. Let's go back to Northgate. We have a couple more quests to do here. Like, we have, um... What's it? S Unsinkable Sam's, uh... Caller, so we can now go give that to him. Because the unsinkable Sam was the one who was trying to romance the cat Maxine, and Maxine won't deal with him because he's poor. Cats, am I right? Am I right, fellas? Fucking cats, man. Fucking What's cats. With Gold you diggers. Bipeds and beer. No better drink than milk. All right. Well, about Maxine. Wink, whiskers. You found my collar. Oh, thank you. Bless you. I shall don it right this instant, and hie me to Maxine as fast as my paws can carry me. You have made me the happiest cat in the world! Indeed you have! <laughs> then, did, did he just fucking pop out of here? What? Alright, uh, he's going to Maxine right now. Chasing that pussy. Let's go. <laughs> The collar I told you about, the one you told me was but the fancy of a dream. Here it is. A band of jewels such as no one in Sicile has ever beheld. Dear me, 
That choker looks absolutely fabulous on you. Simply smashing. I can't believe it's real. Oh, darling Sam, you are a Tom of Means after all. <laughs> that I am, my little tigress. Behold my true color and marry me. Make me yours, and my very life I shall dedicate to your happiness. <laughs> oh, what a passionate puss you are, my darling Sam. As impetuous as ever. But indeed you do seem to have the right and reason to be. Oh, I shall hold you in suspense no longer. Yes, my dear Sam, I will marry you. With a word, you have stopped my heart and set it beating anew with untold vigor. Come, my love, my lean-tailed lady. By the fire of the hearth, let us lie and purr the night away. Alright, that's it. Log is updated and it's done. It's completed. Oh god, Dad, what's the talk? No! About what? About cats? And so Sam's story has a happy end after all. Uh. <laughs> Maxine only agreed to marry him because he's rich now. It wouldn't have if we never found that collar. Maxine only agreed to marry him because he's rich now. <laughs> what a cynical thing to say. She loved him all along, but was worried about the children they might have. That's quite another matter. Uh, shut the fuck up, Ken. Get I'm, fucked. I'm Get pregnant. Romantic. I'm pretty sure I'm just like flip flopping in my quirks. Crafting increased by one. No, you got Lucky Charmed, it's fine. It is a pity oh. indeed to see how this treasure of a cat, this pinnacle of nature's beauty, has been corrupted by the wretched moors of man. Base materialism has darkened the purity of her soul and has seized the very throne where love should rest. Let the story of Sam and his beloved serve as an example of this bitter truth. Between two humans, no love is unconditional. So strongly does this sad depravity seep from our every pore that it adulterates the innocence of what should be stainless spirits. This fucking guy. This fucking guy, I swear. We suffer from the inability to bestow love devoid of logic, devotion devoid of design. Wealth, status, prestige, the carnality of flesh and fortune. Those are the true motivators of the affections between a woman and a man. Love. Oh my it gosh, shut the fuck up! Base <laughs> ambition. A delusion we blindly compel to be true and therefore falsely hold to be absolute. Pity love and be wary of her too, for she is but a deception. <laughs> Love is not a delusion. It's a great one. I can I? A heart washed in bitter streams because I have come to realize that love is but the vagary of fantasies, the intemperance of puerile minds. This is why no one loves you, Jahan. I shall not deny that my mind too was puerile once. That I too loved a woman with all my soul, believing her to be a demon. Me. Ah, <laughs> enough. Forget what I said. Dig love a grave and there let it rot. God damn it. We need to find some black dye for this guy's fucking clothes because he's <laughs> such a fucking edgelord. <laughs> I know. Do you want me to repair your shit, by the way? Nah, it's probably fine. No, I mean... give, it to, give it to fucking Jahan. <laughs> I just imagine he has like a fucking stack of 99 black fabric dye, <laughs> and every time I give him anything, it comes back black. <laughs> I should do that. <laughs> That'd be a good idea. Alright, I sent it back. Alright, what else do we have? Is there any other logs we have here that are really easy? Uh, nope, not this one. Source Hunter's Journey. Holy shit, this quest is long. Because you could imagine, that's not the kind of thing you'd notice straight away. Like, just, like, a pair of gloves turning black, you wouldn't notice that much. But, like, you just slowly, 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 was more and more black. Over time. Fuck. Uh, so we found some aggressive sailors on the beach. Were they protecting some sort of black weapon? What could it be? What, which beach? Aggressive what? Aggressive sailors on the beach. 
Uh, I wish I could see where this was. Cyseal's mighty staff. Might have been the 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 stealth guys, maybe. Yeah, I think so. Like you actually. walked into them and like just fucking suddenly just everyone. Yeah, it has to be that. I'm gonna actually have a look there. What's the black? What's the black thing they're, they're referring to? No, this is just a shipwreck there. There's another one up here that we fought. That wasn't it either. I I have absolutely no idea what that one is. Uh, it's a fabulous five. We cleared the cave. We should get our fair share of the reward as soon as Cyseal pays Mendes, though. Uh, we gotta ask someone about the reward for that. Maybe I'll do that real quick. Uh, I'm gonna just teleport to you. I'm just in town. Yeah. I think I'm supposed to ask the mayor for the reward. What is in that? We, we want to finish up that reward. I think I think it's Cyseal gets the reward. What? Oh, hello. I think you can make a. Please tell me how I can help you during your investigations. I know your plate is full enough to fill you for days. Holy shit! I have like I have fucking uh, ten dialogue options with this guy. All right, uh, join the fabulous five. Let's discuss your assignment again. Wait here. I'll get my beekeeper suit. What the beekeeper suit? Oh wait. Oh yes, the fabulous five. I thought you said the treacherous. Well, m m never mind. They just informed me that they cleared the cave of all undead presence, so I gave them the reward as promised. They just left town. The rest of the world needs saving too. Oh, they truly are fabulous. They just left town. Okay. Uh, well, let's see. They, we killed all the... Uh, that's it? They just left? We don't do anything else with that, do we? They didn't even give us the reward, did they? What are pricks? Let me actually look. Kitty Love. What's it called? It's the Fabulous Five request. Oh, here we go. The Fabulous Five. The Fabulous Five seems to have vanished. They received their pay they received their payment and skipped town. So we just didn't get anything out of it. No reward for us. Uh, we found- what the hell? Headless Nick. We found a play based upon the founding of Saiso. Maybe we can put it to good use. We found a book listing some tried and true jokes. These are some weird things. Oh, uh, there's a guy that wants to meet us in the King Crab Inn. Um... Well, from made it back. Okay, we need to talk to the lieutenant, because they're apparently at the burial grounds. We sent someone back. Uh, Tom, the Adventurer, Expedition Church. We need to go to the church as well at some point. And Undead Scourge. Uh, okay. The West of Sicil. That's the root, root out the source of the undead plague in Sicil. Okay. I think that's an ongoing thing that we just. I don't think. Really. I remember the 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 old guy in the cat in the inn. Like the one you talked about earlier. Yeah. I think he gives you a quest to go kill the orc. Uh, who's in the library? Oh yeah. I like we shouldn't do that because. Like, why would you do that? She's not doing anything wrong. Yeah, uh, pretty much. I'm just gonna go talk to Selena and then get the reward for this, and I think that's it for so now. So good to see you again, Source Hunter. Well, uh, you can teleport to me. No, no. Well, okay, I guess I'll do it. Well, I don't know if I want. Yeah, I guess I'll do it too. Uh, let's see. It's disgusting. They must come from somewhere, from some vile source. I could make a feeble pun about your hunting for said source, but no. The undead are no laughing matter. All I can ask is that you don't give up on us. We need you. I have to talk to you about some matters. I shall be legion. very glad to share what information I can give you. The expeditions, the burial grounds. My legionnaires, they all perished. How fate has treated them wantonly. And if it weren't for you, the archaeologist would surely have died as well. He has much to be thankful for. Were that I had. We lost another four brave souls. Yeah, we know about that Churches one. Have oh, we know about that one too. Okay, so I guess I'll talk to that guy real quick. Where's he at? Wait, why are you over here? You said lieutenant something, right? So I just kind of went over here. No, it wasn't lieutenant. No, no, it wasn't lieutenant. Not that lieutenant. It was the, um... Lieutenant Dan? No, lieutenant Dan. Uh, it was the other guy. Uh, no, the, the lieutenant for the, the army. I already talked to so the one who's it. literally like a small walk away. Yes. I thought you were going to be in the inn. 
the fuck the end? Yeah, no, we were gonna talk to the other guy. The guy that wanted to talk to me in private. So we'll see what he's about. And what in the episode. Dum dee dee dum dee dee dum. This music is literally the best. Actually, we should see if there's any good witchcraft stuff. Oh shit, there's Maxine's here. You haven't left town yet, have you? Jolly good. Join me, why don't you, for a scandalously milky saucer of barrel leaf tea? About unsinkable Sam. Oh, my dearest, dearest Sam. He's positively the tenderest tomcat in the world. And you are the most darling of sweethearts for having reunited him with the wealth he lost to the waves. I met him a pauper, but married him a prince. As a stray did he besiege my heart, but as a sovereign he won it, as a Caesar among cats. A life of love and cheer we owe you. God damn. But poor Sam. Alright. Just being a bitch. Yeah. Go stalking. In the night. Uh, does she have any good the books at all? Of the million it doesn't look like it. Nothing's it jumping out at me. It's like new or exciting. Is this the guy you need to talk to? I guess we'll see. Ah, you have come. Yes. That is most satisfactory. Be gone, a brittle mask of age. Hear me now. Repeat the words of Brittle Tooth, the child snatcher of Carador. Come, play with me, for I'm hungry. Come, play, play, play. About the senses you asked of me. The game, yes. A game of blood and brutality, of death and dexterity. <laughs> Fun as herring the horror harlequin. But like the serpentine stalker, this is before the stab. Hush now, darkness, darling. Hush, hush, and listen to my tale. The elves of Gandavon, they lived in peace, oh yes. But one night, when the moon had hid her face, the orcs of the tribe of Kazuldagar beset our city. They cooked and ate and burned every last one of us. The light of dawn never saw an elf of Gandavum no more. All undone. Every last one of us. Except for me, the midnight rambler, away from the city. I was very old back then already, though indeed I whisper of many years hence. But death shall not find me. Oh no, not until every beast of Kazaldegard has been bled. I may be frail, a withered grey, but the wealth of kings is mine. Countless assassins have ministered to the vengeance that is my want, and now is almost over. By Kala, lady of the last gaze, I swear it is almost done. Only the very last one of the Kazal de Gar still eludes me. The crowning kill that would seal its fate and mine alike. I have tracked her down by the curse of the spine spear I have. She does not know her ill-shapen son is setting fast. Color the dusk red, O oh sword of youth. Bloody the day with the bramble sap that runs through the veins of Victoria. Bring me the amulet that clings to her flesh, soon to fade. <laughs> and yours shall be the bounty of vindication. Mine shall be its sanguine satisfaction after long, long last. The Matargo would be Victoria, the, or or the girl orc. Yes, Victoria. She is the one whose heart must be held in hand. The heart around which the fingers of that hand must clench and tighten until its choking flesh bulges with blood and its beat slowly breaks. I think we found Jahan's uh, long-lost brother. De I was going to say we found Jahan's dad. <laughs> the orcs of Gazultaka, they knew my name. Oh, yes. By the bite of the roving rattler, they knew my design. 
And so they sought to save their last, an infant, she who was to be queen, to no avail, oh no. Years, how many I know not, years I searched, and now she has been found. Her name is that of a woman, her employment that of a civilized being, but by the fork of Barbara Maneater she is nothing but an orc. A cest of nature, one of a misbegotten litter dragged into life from the tumoured womb of a filthy, coarse-haired beast that was humped like a dog in the darkness of a stinking hollow. Victoria, librarian, <laughs> daughter, <laughs> adopted child of Cecil, mayor of Cecil. There is bloodlust in you. I can feel it. Let it out. Set it free. Undo the last of the Kazuldagar. By the breasts of Sishara Goat Sucker, give me my revenge! I'll take my leave. Tell me more about the Reapers. <laughs> oh, I can talk to each other. That was quite the radical change we witnessed. <laughs> He's right there. I never would have thought that the benign old man we met outside <laughs> would turn out to be a vengeance driven aficionado of assassins. Uh. He is as much a savage as those orcs. And how is Victoria guilty of her tribe's crime if she was but a babe at the time? A babe. Little piggy. Indeed, Victoria probably doesn't even know about her past. And yet she's on a... Let's call him eccentrics hit list. Forgiving. The hunters go there we stalking got. in the night. By the needles of the million bleeder, they'll end it all. Need cursed. End it all in blood. All right, we're gonna save it here, and this is all the time we got for today, guys. Next time we'll continue. Take care. Fuck.